The singer whose latest album is called Love is getting a lot of hate right now. John Cole is apparently part of an investigation into a sex trafficking operation. Related to Jeffrey Epstein and Ghislaine Maxwell is out, and it contains more shocking allegations. Amanda Bynes arrested in New York City. We have time to do the press myself and I because I'm so dumb out. Thank for Dan. Plus, like being in the abusive relationship. The way I'm abusive producer. Absolutely. And he's in that environment. Kurt Cobain was the lead singer of the group Nirvana. And this morning, his body found a home. Another casualty of success. Chris Cornell. Cornell was pronounced dead at 1.30 a.m. on May 18, 2017. The death of Chester Bennington was as shocking as it was tragic. Good reason for trouble. Just two months earlier, the singer had attended the funeral of his close friend, Soundgarden singer Chris Cornell. Sometimes you meet somebody and it's like you've known them forever. And Bennington was found dead in his California home on July 20th. Okay, Chris Cornell, him and his wife had a foundation, him and Chester were best friends. The conspiracy theory, I don't know if it's true. Okay, the French citizen spent her life in the relentless glare of the public eye. Died in a student car in Paris, and I declined to replace the jury of the body. Superstar status, worldwide fame, and a life in the spotlight. Lisa Left Eye Lopez, what was meant to be a serene escape, turned into a horrifying tragedy. The last minutes of Lopez's life were a collision of speed and sudden chaos. Help! Please help me, help me. One of the young stars of one of TV's most beloved shows, Everybody Loves Raymond, is dead. It broke out Thursday. Romano said, I'm shocked and terribly saddened. It was a wonderful and sweet kid to be around. Off my desk today with President Corby and the plaintiff, and Sean Peter Paul being the defendant. Now, what the heck happened to these two?